after the Senate issued an arrest warrant against him, the Davao and Pasig courts have initiated legal proceedings against the so-called anointed son of God. Now here's the report. The Davao City Prosecutor's Office has recommended the filing of charges against Kingdom of Jesus Christ leader Pastor Apollo Kibuloy. The embattled pastor and others are facing charges of sexual assault and maltreatment. The recommended bail for sexual assault is around 180,000, while it's 80,000 pesos for maltreatment. A complaint for qualified human trafficking of a 17-year-old girl is also filed before the Pasig Court. Unlike the other charges, this one is non-bailable. Kibuloy can also face a lifetime imprisonment and pay a 5 million peso fine if he is found guilty of qualified human trafficking. Before this, Senate President Juan Miguel Zubiri has finally signed the arrest warrant against Kibuloy. This is for continuously snubbing the Senate hearing about his alleged abuses of KOJC members. We tried to do our best to, uh, uh, of course, to give uh, due process to Pastor Kibuloy. So I requested the chairperson to uh, give out a short post order. And of course, Pastor, Pastor Kibuloy's camp answered it was not uh, satisfactory on the part of the committee, and therefore we had no other choice but to uh, issue the uh, warrant of arrest. In response, Kibuloy Scamp said they respect the Senate's decision. They said they will seek all available legal remedies to protect the pastor's constitutional rights regarding his decision to skip the Senate hearings. Reporting for News 5, Elaine Fulhenshaw, We Are One News.